Then you're going to ruin my career, and that's fine. That, that's, not, that's not the intent <laughs> of what I'm I am here drunk, for. And I'm, I just... New video from a Travis County deputy's dash cam. The night District Attorney Rosemary Lindbergh was arrested for drunk driving. Good evening, I'm Leslie Rohde. Robert Hadlock is off tonight. This video, the first glimpse of the traffic stop two Fridays ago that landed Lindbergh in jail, and our Robert Maxwell has been looking at it, and there's plenty to see. There really is. You know, there's more than an hour of video that we've been going over for the last hour or so since we got the video into the newsroom here at KXAN. This, of course, is video of the DUI road stop the evening of April 12th involving Rosemary Lindbergh. We picked a moment here to show you after deputies came upon the scene of a reported erratic driver out on FM 620. At this point, Lemberg and the deputy are in a parking lot away from the road for their safety. He's attempting to conduct a horizontal gaze test. It's used to track someone's eye movement using a light. I'm the, I'm the district attorney. I mean, I, you think I'm not going to pull over? No, I'm aware of who you are, ma'am. No, I don't care. He, what is he doing? <laughs> you all think I'm a drug dealer or what's going on here? No, ma'am. <laughs> okay. Not at all. What do you want? Okay, I, I, I'm still trying to look at your eyes. I'm gonna... Yeah, it's fine. Okay, again, can you And so I, I went up, I had a, I went to a friend's house tonight. Okay. Had a couple of drinks. I am not drunk. Okay, and that's what these tests and, are going to help you know, me determine, ma'am. <laughs> Now, the arrest affidavit says Lemberg cooperated with the field sobriety tests at first, then did not obey instructions on walking a straight line. The arrest affidavit described her attitude as excited and cocky. Now, Lemberg told deputies she had a couple vodka sodas at her friend's house that night on the 12th before her arrest. She refused to submit to a roadside breath test, and once a warrant was secured two and a half hours later, her blood alcohol level was found to be nearly three times the legal limit.